Hello everybody, today we're in Orchard Park, home of the Bills Go Bills. And we've got something interesting we wanted to show you. Okay everybody, we're back. And I'd like to introduce you to somebody or I'll let her introduce herself. Hi there, my name is Janine and we're from Orchard Park, New York. And we are very happy and proud to show you this awesome 2013 camper conversion van that our youngest boy um, bought and alongside his college friend who's an engineer uh, designed this in a custom manner for someone's dream drive and I can't wait to show you all the fun features it has for your new adventures. Could you tell us about what what the vehicle is? Okay, so it's a 2013 Ford Transit conversion van, and I believe we're the second owner. It was first purchased or used as a uh, utility vehicle for a local company. We are the second owner. Um, it hasn't really been driven as a camper as of yet. We're waiting for it to find its new home and it has about 119,000 original miles. It's never been in an accident. Um, it has a clean and clear title, and it's in good working condition with all features um, intact and ready to be uh, used. And um, it's a gas sipper, and I think it's gonna be perfect for one or two people who want to take it on the road and have some fun. Okay. Let's go ahead and show everybody um, what's going on with what they've done inside of it. It's pretty amazing the work that they've done. Front seat, the driving area. The seats are pulled a, a little bit forward so that the bed could be opened up all the way. Now you said that your son's friend, the engineering student and his father, um, your son bought the van and- um, your... Locally here in town. And then the two, the uh, college friend, my son's college friend, who's an engineer, and his father, who's also an engineer, did this as a winter project in 2021 during uh, COVID and um, took their time, many months, constructing, planning, developing uh, the custom work, the bed, the storage area, the cooktop, um, the uh, cooler area, the lighting, so it would really be comfortable for someone to, and easy for someone to travel and enjoy a small vehicle, but yet have all the um, bells and whistles of a, maybe a full-size camper. It looks as though there's a couple of storage cubbies um, under the bed in the front here. Correct. One on each side, if, if I did look at the other side, right? And then, you know, I think as you know, you're traveling and if you needed more space, you could always put your goodies on top of the bed and then just reposition those um, to the front if you needed to have more sl sl sleep space. Uh, this is, you, you can see the craftsmanship that they put into um, the roof and into the sides and getting this all sit up situated. A lot of hard work went into it. And this is the kitchen side that, that pulls out with underneath storage so underneath storage underneath uh, or underneath the stove and then you have the Coleman so stove and you have a little um Yeti charger in the uh, inside along that, with the LED lighting for nighttime or more task lighting to read or just enjoy a campfire it has LED lighting underneath the edges all the way around also to add some light to the to the rig. Let's close that up. We'll all see. the cabinetry is secured by sliders that keeps everything in position while you're traveling. We'll check out the other side. On the other side again, you have storage underneath. Nice little cabinet set up for cutting board and a cooler that sets inside. I'll go over to this other side and show that it does still have some 
and the side there is another cubby for more storage underneath this side with the bed and you can see the LED lighting that's strung up against in the ceiling we're gonna let you know now that the van is for sale and that's actually how I found it looking on marketplace I found it and I thought it was really cool so I reached out um, and if if anybody would is interested um, I can go ahead and put a link in the description down below so that you can contact them about the van and I'll let you go ahead and if there's anything else you want to talk about the van then or so if you find this to be a good fit for you we'd love to have it have a good home and you can contact me at colejanine at gmail.com. It's K-O-H-L-J-E-A-N-N-I-N-E -N 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 -E at gmail.com. And the asking price is $17,800. And I'd love to see this beautiful uh, workmanship go on the road and be enjoyed for your next dream drive. And there you have it, everybody. Um... This is a really cool little um, van setup, and I think that somebody would really love to be able to have it for getting around. Um, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. If you have any questions at all about the van, um, put it in the description down below, and we can get you in contact with them, and everything will be good. Um, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. We're going to show you a lot more of this kind of stuff, and I'm hoping everybody enjoys it. Alright, bye now.